Yo, what's up guys, it's the Goblin, and today what I have for you guys is a beastly 3 minute KEM strike on the map, Strike Zone, what a coincidence there, and I'm using the Vepper in this game with the Souncer and the Extended Mag, and this is an absolutely insane gameplay, it's pretty good, it's like a 3 minute KEM, it's something that I'm pretty, you know, proud of, and uh, if you guys do enjoy it, if you could drop a like on it for me, that would be freaking awesome, basically what I was using, I was using that pink cam on, I like that pink cam on all my guns, I got this gameplay yesterday, I got about 10 KEM strikes yesterday, so I'm not doing too bad at this game with a variety of different guns and there's tons of different guns that I like I'm gonna have lots of different videos up with more specialist setups and I did find out the best specialist setup for going for KM strikes thanks to my buddy refresh and I uh, really do enjoy this setup so if you guys would like to see that let me know in that in the comment section below so the Vepper here is my favorite SMG in the game you guys uh, if you guys have Call of Duty Ghost let me know in the comment section below what is your favorite SMG in the game and if you don't have Call of Duty Ghost I'd be interested to see let me know if you don't have the game yet uh, that would be interesting to see how many of my subscribers do not have the game that you guys are missing out because this game is good if you play on a certain amount of maps. There is problems with the game obviously which I've talked about before. But basically what you can do is if you lobby surf and only play like 4 or 5 maps which is kind of a shame that you even have to do that. It's really a shame that only 4 or 5 out of 14 maps are good enough to be played consistently. But I think that most of the maps were made for ground war and then you know this map strike zone is the smallest one in the game it's freaking awesome i get a km strike like quite a bit on this game and, and this map and you can even get one from a care package here i mean i've gotten so many from care packages like i got like doubles from care packages and stuff like that it's kind of funny but um basically you'll see when i do call in the km strike how the map sor sort of changes which is a cool feature that they added in this call of duty game that this map is basically like two maps i kind of like how the map plays once it's blown up because personally it eliminates camping spots eliminates lots of corners where people like to hide in and it is kind of nice to see people not sitting in quarters too much which is uh you know kind of cool but yeah back on topic with this gun this is the vepper it is the best submachine gun in my opinion some guys like to say the mtar some say the vector some even say the k7 or different stuff like that but in my opinion this is my favorite smg my favorite assault rifle is the ak-12 and i absolutely love that but yeah basically you know this gameplay is pretty cool how, how I played this map was I had kind of played it safe because I realized I got my specials bonus in one minute and I really didn't want to F that up. So I was like, you know, I'll play it safe. I'll control this area. And this area over here is by the pro shop. Uh, this area right in front, you can see the big pro shop sign on the door. They like to spawn there if you're keeping them at C domination, uh, which is this way. Obviously, this is kill confirmed. This guy just got absolutely crapped on, which was freaking awesome. I was pumped in this gameplay. When I got this, I was like, holy crap. That was super fast. That was super fast. And I went through it and it was three minutes, which is pretty fast for, you know, a release day KEM, I guess. Way better than I was getting Moabs. I think I'm going to do really good at this game. I'm definitely having a lot of fun. I think once Ground War is put in and once I get the new consoles, if I'm able to get those new consoles because they're probably going to be sold out a lot of places but mind you I do live in Canada so it's not that big of a that big of a rush for video games or anything like that like when I went to I went to Future Shop for the midnight release and there was like 10 or 15 people there and they all got free like freaking uh, Call of Duty beanies or toques as we call them in Canada it was definitely a lot of fun and uh, I do actually have quite a bit of playtime on this game I'm almost max level I believe I have about 15 hours in two days which yes I need to go outside that is a lot of playtime that's like seven hours a day or seven or eight hours a day but I've just been playing it all night with my friends and it's the gamer experience it's the gamer lifestyle it's a lot of fun so look at this map the map just completely gets shifted as soon as you call in the KEM strike but that's about it Hope you guys did enjoy this video. If you did, and if you guys could smash up that likes on this video, I'll have another video later, another KEM strike with a good specialist class setup or something like that. Hope you guys did enjoy. Subscribe if you're new. And as always, subscribe for Cookie. I'm out. Peace.